All right, so for this dish, I decided to do a pasta bolognese. My dad makes a wicked bolognese sauce and he would agree with me that he might not be the best cook in the world, but when he spends six to eight hours simmering his sauce down, enjoying the intermittent things that he does during the day to just monitor that sauce, you really get some complex flavors and a delicious profile overall. My son loves this dish as well, and he always looks forward to going to grandpa's house and enjoying some delicious pasta bolognese. So what we're gonna do here is warm up our sauce in the pan just until it starts bubbling away. So get that all in there and turn on the stove. And we also gave you this delicious bit of Parmesan cheese which we'll be topping it off with. Uh, my awesome camera woman and cinematographer here has been nibbling away at this. Feel free to do the same thing. We've packed your cup kind of full for a little snack intermittently. So we'll come back and check on this in a couple minutes as it warms up and add our noodles. Oh, look at that delicious simmering sauce. If you think about it, this sauce has probably been simmering now, not on our stovetop, but in our kitchen for upwards of eight hours. Absolutely delicious, complex flavors. So what we're gonna do is add our noodles and toss it over top. I'm gonna let this cook for just another minute, just to make sure everything gets nicely coated reduce down perfectly. All right, so our noodles are nicely coated and we're ready to plate. So you're gonna grab your handy dandy spaghetti grabber. And I like a lot of pasta. So we're just going to scoop all of this out onto one plate. And this is gonna be all for me, no matter what my cameraman says. She is going to not get any of my bolognese. And after that, I'm gonna take our nice shredded Parmesan cheese here, sprinkle it over the top, and that should slowly soften up. And there you have it. 